All right, just about to do the uh, combat for the Austro-Hungarians. I'm just grabbing my sheet here. It's more, it's not really, well, I guess it is obviously a little bit of a, well, it is about the combat, but uh, it's, quite to be honest with you, there's a few things that I just want to make sure that I pop into the video for myself, so for later that um, um, I'm going to re remember. The main, th one thing that I am kind of proud about is the fact that here, I think I remember, uh, I said in a previous video, um, number eight, so who are you, number eight? Hold on here. You're the combat. So you're the 46th Infantry Division and the 1st Brigade of the 17th Infantry Division. They were under uh, 4th Army Direct from here. I uh, switched them over to 8th Corps, and then when I went to go... Um, do the battle, supply the battle, so they're going to be um, eighth core here. I've already re removed the, um, they used to have two strength uh, supply points. And then I was like, oh shoot, I screwed up the movement points because you need four, um, not including um, zones of control issues for movement purposes. I'm not saying for like uncontested. So that's one, two, and then three, four for the woods. And uh, for some reason, when I was uh, going to do the final calculation, I went, oh no. It's five movement points instead of four, and um, I was like, well, you can just switch it back to Fourth Army Direct. I'm like, no, <laughs> excuse me, the orders have gone out. Um, I, I'm not going to play that silly nonsense. It's like if you if I made a, uh, uh, a mistake, it's the same as um, not focusing on a single track and taking a look at what, like, the whole nine yards of what I have to move around, and I haven't... If I start moving things around uh, and then later it's like, oh shoot, I needed to use that. Well, it's too bad. That's why I'm looking at. How the hell is this battery dying so quickly? This sucks. I may have to stop the uh, stop the thing or do a um, camcorder thing because this is just not working. What a bummer. So I'm just going to say, oh, I better move quickly then. Maybe that's how it's going to end. Um, so I did manage to uh, extract an extra two st uh, strength points around here. So yeah, I've moved over the second core to fill up the spot that first core shifted on over. And like I said, the way I'm doing it uh, very quickly here is that um, a pretend well, it uh, works out. I'm just adding some uh, narrative to it that these guys are going to be doing the artillery. And if there's any casualty, well, there are going to be. I'm getting these guys to uh, supply. Um, um, They've got a total of four strength points, so that's going to be two supply points they've got to um, they've got to do. So here we go. We're at eleven uh, attacking strength points. We'll see if uh, you can see. Nope, you can't. So I'll uh, hmm. see if I can zoom out. There we go. That works. Hurry up, Chris, because it's going to go. Okay. So this is for the uh, the Russians attacking from here, here, and here. Um, across it's had an awful lot of um, well in, in total it's 11 attacking strength points but only remember only four of which are supplied all the rest are going in so it's a two um, hold on there we go. sorry about that there you go uh, just there's so many counters and I didn't uh, whatever so that means they're guaranteed uh, yeah there was a one in six chance that uh, uh, the Russians could have inflicted two hits so that's one hit um, that's going to be uh, suffered on, um, well, it's obviously going to have to be the 46th uh, Infantry Division for the Russians because they've got three strength points. The other guys would be eliminated with only one, so that's not going to happen. So now we go quickly to the Russians counterattacking. Um, they've got four strength points. They're not retreating, and they're fully supplied, so that's 12. There we go. And a plus one to their die roll. It's a six. Holy shoot. <laughs> so, it's been a strange, strange uh, things with the combats. That's all I got to say. Holy cow. So they do two hits. You can see that in there. So, and like I said, the uh, the casualties are going to be inflicted on the first core. And that's it. And now we go off to dessert, as far as I'm concerned, which is the uh, Germans. Um, I got to figure out, because, uh, yeah, they, they just got such an over... A like, lot of decision uh, points to make. And... Um, a lot of troops and a lot of uh, strength and supply. All right, that's it. Hope you have a great, well, great Monday or Tuesday if you're in Australia and whatnot. See ya.